Okay, Mrs. Chua, now we're going to move on to the abdominal exam. Okay, so I'm just going to have you raise your gown just below your breasts. I'm going to lower this a little bit more so I can get a good inspection of your abdomen. Just have you bend your knees up so we can relax your abdominal muscles. Good. And again, I'm inspecting for any obvious um, masses or hernias or pulsations. Okay. Have you bring your head up. Again, checking for hernias and relax. Good. Okay, now I'm going to auscultate the abdomen. And... Um, We'll auscultate at a minimum at four quadrants. Okay, and you have positive bowel sounds in all four quadrants. Now I'm going to go ahead and auscultate the aorta using the bell. And there are no bruits. Okay, next I'm going to percuss the uh, abdominal quadrants. and percuss for the size of the liver. And it should be between about 6 and 12 centimeters. Okay. Now we'll go ahead and um, palpate the abdomen. First lightly. Just tell me if you feel any discomfort. Okay. And then a little more deeply. Okay. And now I'm going to palpate your liver. Go ahead and breathe in for me. And out. Good. And palpate the spleen. Go ahead and breathe in. And out. Good. And palpate for the kidneys. And for the kidneys. Okay. And then I'm going to palpate the size of the aorta. Is very normal. Okay. Finally, I'm going to check your inguinal region. All right. Just have you straighten your legs out. And here, I'm just going to have you hold your underwear to the side. Good. And here, I'm checking and um, palpating for any femoral uh, hernias, also for femoral pulses and inguinal nodes. Okay. And then finally, auscultate for femoral bruise. Okay, and we'll do the same on the other side. And I'll just start by auscultating here. Okay, and again I'm checking for femoral pulses, femoral hernias, and inguinal nodes. Okay? Very good.